<sighs> I apologize for being so abrupt. You must find me strange for wanting to speak with you alone. I will tell it to you straight. I have a strong sense that, as a knight of beauty, I have a duty to fight this battle. I propose that I disembark from the Express to confront the giant sting directly. My strategy is to pierce its stomach with my lance, triggering spasms that may cause it to eject the Express. It is challenging for me to articulate this phenomenon. Yet, when I observe certain entities, an indistinct sensation of beauty arises from my core, discernible only by instinct. Perhaps my long solitude traversing the cosmos has made it difficult to discern where these sentiments originate. But as a knight, I realize my obligation is to safeguard the seed that embodies beauty, standing as a bulwark to defend it against all. The Astral Express is that seed. It feels warm, like a home to me. I am certain this is thanks to the strong friendship you have with one another. That is why I must swear to fight to protect this warmth, rather than be protected by it. I am willing, time and time again, to protect these seeds of beauty, to allow them to bloom into pure and radiant flowers to demonstrate my devotion to them. It is an inherent part of the journey of Argenti. In the pursuit of defending beauty, I have bled into unconsciousness, and in the ensuing stupor, I have witnessed countless times their traces spreading from beneath my feet, reaching into the unknown before me. My rational mind tells me yes, yet my heart tells me to believe. In those past hallucinations, I kept running. Their footprints on the mire-ridden path moved me to a sadness beyond tears. And every time, I was a breath away from catching a glimpse of their figure. Yes, this is my duty. It is a never-ending cycle of falling and standing up again. Each time I wander closer to death, it gets me closer to the path the beauty once walked. This is my vow as a knight of beauty. We were interrupted halfway through our battle. As a warrior, articulation has never been my forte. Yet, I still needed to impart the remaining half to you. I apologize. I have been rambling. As I said, articulation has never been my forte. Let us return to the point at hand. 
Do I have your support? You do? Thank you! Your understanding is more precious than any treasure. I have faced many a traveler, encountered flattery and provocation aplenty. It is rare to find a spirit as pure as yours. In that case... Please forgive my inappropriate manner. Our friendship is new, but was forged in the heat of battle, which I only wish we had been able to conclude. I hope now we may conclude it still, that I may leave without regret. I shall prove my will with the blade, defend my honor, and uphold my dignity with the protocol of combat. Win or lose, I will accept the outcome, and thus bid you farewell. My friend, it is an honor to fight against you. Come on, let's do this. Every petal in life's garden will be swept away by the wind of time. Bring it on, Walker. Draw. There's no reasoning with you bunch anymore. There are only two kinds of people in the world. Those with a loaded gun. Those who dig their own grave. My turn. Eternal melody. Let me tend to your wounds. That wasn't for free. Fire! Bully. Take your positions. Let's improvise. Christ, the mood is set just right. Let the show begin.
Look, listen, feel, kick! Bear witness to honor. And that wasn't for free.
Take your positions. Thank you. 